I can't stand properly anymore. So the pension, the fixation, that was a problem. Then as the pile, uh, the files piled up, bureaucratic delay in the pension cell of Delhi University. So I'm hopeful that things will move and, you know, I can get a steady income. My crisis came when I developed this problem which became acute in November when I had a fall also and then I struggled to walk that all activity stopped and finally it was diagnosed that my disease is weakness of motor neurons in the muscles in my right leg. Consequently it has led to a foot drop problem in my right leg. So I am now, it's a double blow. You know, there's my right foot is so weak. Every day the physiotherapist tries to make me stand. My feet, buck, uh, right foot buckles. Oh, I put all the weight on my left foot. I can't stand properly anymore. Not just me, uh, over 350 teachers are without pension. Uh, this, the government of India in the 1970s started the pension scheme for retired professors from central universities. In February 1988, I withdrew and went to the General Provident Fund uh, from CPF to GPF. Now, <coughs> university had given certain deadlines Teachers being as they are, some didn't follow the deadlines, some signed late, sometimes the college sent it late. So there were bureaucratic problems. But in 2014, uh, a court case started. The previous vice chancellor, there were some you know, objections raised about, you know, this pension date. And the previous vice chancellor, they started a court case. Hmm? That has been lingering. Cons I was working then, I was fully, imp uh, you know, at the peak of my career. So all of us, as we retired, we became part of this waiting list for pensions. Some categories got cleared. Gradually, people who retired when 2015-16 were cleared. There would be problems of fixation. In my case, it was a question, you know, there have been several pay commissions. So, the pension, the fixation, that was a problem. Then, as the, pile, uh, the files piled up, bureaucratic delay in the pension cell of Delhi University. Now, you see, I have had to calculate. Income is practically negligible. With the economy in a slump, investments are giving no returns or negligible returns. There's no income. The costs are mounting. My expenses are six to seven times my income. It comes to 60 to 70,000 rupees a month. And it's my own house. I have Upstairs also some room, two rooms which I give on rent, like that's my only income. And so that's why suddenly in the last two months problems have become magnified. Through the pressure from the media, different media houses they showed on television. So pressure was put on the Honorable Sports Minister, I must say, he responded with great promptness and consideration and kindness. Uh, journalists, senior journalists talked to him. Uh, the president of Delhi Soccer Association talked to him. So he said he'll take up the case. He has been very prompt. He pressurized my vice chancellor. And credit to them that some files have started moving.
generation which I grew up in, the Indian media was very strong. The fourth estate, you know, was a pillar of Indian democracy. And we always looked to probe. We didn't believe in hyperbole and superficiality. So all I had said was, and which I still strongly maintain, and which the, I've been proved right, history will prove me right, that why start ATK? Mohan Bagan, East Bengal are the biggest clubs in Asia. See, I did work for another TV channel, so financially I was all right, it was up to them. My principal of Sri Guru Tegh Bahadur Khalsa College, where I taught for over 40 years, uh, he contacted me and sent some papers. They've been very considerate, they send a man home. I've signed certain papers. Slowly my fixation is being done in the Seventh Pay Commission. So I'm hopeful that things will move and, you know, I can get a steady income. So at present, it's a rehabilitation. It's going slowly, slowly, but it's taking time and it'll take time. It's a question of months, it's not weeks. I have to realize, I have to focus on rehabilitation, more exercise, physiotherapy, medicine, which I'm taking. And I have shown it to a couple of hospitals, doctors. At least the treatment now has been identified. I'm hopeful, I have to remain positive.